Hi everyone. Um, look at my messy desk. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, now tonight I want to make really, really quick cards, but it didn't happen. It took a bit longer than I thought. In my head, this was the perfect plan. There you go. Best laid plans and all that sort of stuff. It's Jill Lancet and I'm coming to you from beautiful downtown Greystains in Sydney, Australia. And autumn has finally arrived, thank goodness, because, um, yeah, this is my favourite season of the year. I just love it. So temperatures are a little bit cooler. We've got a bit of rain and I am so happy about that. Big weekend for Stampin' Up! this weekend. Um, all around the world, we had on stage. Uh, the uh, Australian one was in Melbourne this year. Um, I didn't go. Uh, I can't justify the air flights and the accommodation, but when it's in Sydney, I'm there. I am there. It is great fun. Um, you get to preview the new catalogue, which will be out soon. Uh, the old catalogue ends on the 29th, I think it is, of April. End of April, anyway. Um, and so, too, does the uh, mini catalogue. So, we're getting a new one. The old stuff has to make way for the new stuff. So... Anyway, what I thought I would do was I had a kit um, and it's still available. It's called the um, Saying Thank You Kit or Saying Thanks Kit. Now, all our kits come in these great little boxes. Everything is in there. But, you know, I like to think outside of that box and I wanted to go over a technique that Connie Stewart uh, has done in the past and I yeah was really at gung-ho for that so here's the kit it's called saying thanks and it makes uh, three of each of these three cards and they're all appreciation cards or thank you cards um, but yeah sometimes you just need a, a really quick um, birthday card so that's what I thought I was doing. So what I decided to do was I decided to get out the die set. Um, and you can probably see it better here. It's called Wanted to Say. And it has your two kind, happy birthday, celebrate, feel better soon. It has the words, but it also has the shadow uh, behind it. And I wanted to combine the two to make quick cards but it's taken me longer than I thought but anyway I'm going to show you what I've done so far so Connie Stewart just got some card stock and popped this tape it's just clear clear packing tape so she popped that over a piece of card stock ran it through a with a word die and you end up with these glossy greetings. So I got a little bit carried away and I did like a whole pile of them and then I got even more carried away and I put some uh, self-adhesive, you know, this self-adhesive uh, backed paper onto some, com some computer paper and then I did some more and it ended up being too thick. So learn, learn by my mistakes, guys. Um, now, you can see all of these products. You can only see the kits. These kits are only available online. So you need to go to my online store if you want to look at those. Um, if you want to look at all the stuff that's in the catalogue, you can actually view that online as well. So if you know the name of it or just type in online exclusive, it's, if it's an online exclusive like the kits are, um, you can type in stamp sets and it'll bring up all the stamp sets. It'll tell you what's new and things like that. But anyway, I'm going to get jump, jump straight into this because I'm so far behind now. Um, the first thing I wanted to talk about was uh, Stampin' Up! have these, um, in, you know, like giving back to the community and all that sort of um, really good uh, things. And I, I want to just mention this very, very close to my heart, this little um, wildlife rehabilitation centre. It's called Kana Maluka. Now, here's a picture of it. I hope you can see this. It's a not-for-profit 
um, Wildlife Rehabilitation Centre. It's in Tasmania and it is run by my nephew. That good, good looking guy there is my nephew. Not this good looking guy, um, this good looking guy. Um, that's Duncan, his partner Jess and their family, they run this, they've, they've devoted their lives to running this rehabilitation uh, centre down there in beautiful, beautiful uh, Tasmania. Um, and as I said, they're not for profit. So they actually rely very, very heavily on public donation. So I'm on my soapbox now. If anybody can give anything to Canamaluca Wildlife Rehabilitation Centre, um, I would be extremely grateful. Uh, I will put the details in the description. I'll put the link for you. The, these these guys will go out in the middle of the night or, you know, if a, the public call and say that um, an Australian native animal has been injured or has been killed, they will go out and they will, will um, quite often come back with a joey or a baby wombat. I don't know what baby wombats are called. Hmm. Okay. Anyway, they will come back with those and they will feed them, they will care for them, they will give them veterinary um, assistance if they need it, and then they are able to release them back into the wild. So it's a very, very, very important um, thing for Australian wildlife. Australia has some of the most unique animals in the world. Um, if anybody saw a kangaroo, they would know instantly where it came from. Um, so, yeah, if you could, I would really appreciate that. I mean, I know everybody's not in a position to donate, but if you can donate $1 per month, that would be excellent. Enough of my soapbox. I'm going to get on with this now. So here's one of the cards that are from the kit. Now, it's this one here. Now, they've put it in that orientation. I'm changing everything. I'm changing everything. Um, but what I did was um, I cut out these words. I did what Connie does. I put the packing tape over the cardstock. It's got double-sided adhesive on the back. I've done one in green, one in red. And you wait till you see how they turn out on this black background. Now, the background cuts it all one piece. The other die cuts it in separate pieces. So look, I can mix and match these colours. So I, I just wanted a happy, happy birthday card. So I'm going to pop this on here. Easy peasy because it's already got the self-adhesive stuff on it. So I'm putting the H down. Sorry, Duncan, I'm putting that right over you and your little, I think it's a patty melon. Comment in the comments, Duncan or Jess, if I've got that wrong. And let us know, what's a baby wombat called? Right, so there's happy. Now his birthday. So if I put the B down first, and then just carefully drop them down, I can press them when I'm hap happy with their, um, where they've landed. Done! Look at that. Done and done. Right, I'm going to give that a big bit of a rub over from the back. And look at that. How happy is that? And it's glossy. Look at that. It's so glossy. It's not funny. It's beautiful. Now, what I wanted to do was, um, I'm not stamping the inside. I'm in a hurry. Sorry. Sorry. i got things to do. <laughs> and... Uh, yeah, but look, think outside that box. That box comes with everything in it, but you don't have to do what's in the box. Now, this one here, these two here, I decided to um, put strips of different coloured cardstock and then die cut them, and I've ended up with rainbow. How fun is that? Now, I don't know which one to use. I think I'll, I think I'll oh gosh, I think I'll go this one. I don't know. Anyway, suffice it to say, I, I, no, I'm going to use this one. I like this one. There's enough rainbow happening there. So I'm going to, oh, no, I'm not going to glue that yet. Oh, gosh. 
I'm just going to pop these out. These come in with the kit. Um, and you'll notice they are in all different languages. So I'm just going to say, just wanted to say. And it's meant to say, just wanted to say thank you or, you know, whatever. But I just want to say happy birthday. So I'm going to try and figure out where I'm going to put this. Okay. Just wanted to say happy birthday. Now I'm going to do some card surgery here. I'm just going to cut, cut this off here like that. And I'm going to cut this one off here like that. And I think I'll just glue those flat and pop that up. What do you reckon? Easy peasy. Right, bit of glue, bit of glue on that one. There we go. Bit of glue on this one. And I've put them at an angle, that way uh, they don't have to be perfectly straight. Just wanted to say, and then I'll pop this one up with some mini dimensionals. And this card is done, done and dusted. Now, if you cut all of these out and pop them in your little box of tricks, I have this little box of tricks where I've got um, loads of greetings that I've made. I can just pull them out whenever I need them and I've got an instant greeting. So yeah, it doesn't have to be a fancy box like that as if that was a fancy box. But anyway, um, you know what I mean. It doesn't have to be like that. Get that old Tupperware container out <laughs> that's in the back of the cupboard there that you haven't used for yonks. And uh, that's just as good as anything else. Okay, now, they're on. Let's go through the tedium of taking them off now. But yeah, I, I, I admire people that will actually, um, you know, stand for something. And Jess and Duncan and the kids, they're all involved. They rely on volunteers to help them. Um, they rely on donations from the public. And yeah, they're, like if there's an emergency, they're there, they're there. They don't ask questions. They just go and yeah, I just so admire that. So there we go. What do you think about that? Just wanted to say happy birthday. Where will I put that? Any, many, money. There we go. That'll do. And in the kit, what have I done with them? Oh, here they are. Um, you got these little... Um, square like they look like confetti they look all the world like confetti and they're those beautiful iridescent so let's put some of those on let's get some of those happening and i think we might just put another one down there oops it's choosing where it wants to go and that's that done look at that beautiful shiny um greeting now, I'll show you the other ones I made. Look at that one. And that's Tahitian Tide. That is uh, going to be a soon-to-be-retired um, in colour, I think. Um, here's the, one of the other cards. Look, celebrate. You're the best. Beautiful rainbow. Bright, happy yellow. And look, feel better soon. How's that for a Get Well card? Anyway, look... I've, I'm sorry if I've, I'm, I'm rushing you tonight, um, but I wanted to tell you about um, Duncan and Jess and the Rehabilitation Centre down in Tasmania. Um, I wanted to tell you about On Stage. I had so many things to tell you. I had so many things that didn't quite go according to plan and it left me a little bit short for time. But look, 14, nearly 15 minutes and I made that card. I showed you all of that stuff. Let me know what you think. Um, in the comments about 
thinking a little bit outside the box, using up your um, packing tape or sticky tape as we call it in, in Australia, um, making these gorgeous, look at that, look at the shine on that, beautiful. And the backgrounds on these cards are absolutely gorgeous. So, yeah, let me know what you think. And thank you again. Thank you so much for spending some time with me on your Sunday night. And I'll see you guys all on Thursday, hopefully. And uh, please take care. Thank you so much. See you. Bye.